Hey everybody, Shiny Sephiroth here, and I am coming at you from a new Target. I actually don't know if I've ever been to this one. So uh, I just finished wrestling practice up in my university, and oh my gosh, that was the toughest workout we have had. We uh, This time, we only spent about, I don't know, 20 minutes doing warm-ups and conditioning drills, and then we just wrestled the entire time. It was so tough. Um, so I, I turned 38 in about a week and a half. And so uh, I do not recover <laughs> the same as uh, the rest of the people on my team. They're all about between uh, 18 and 23, 24 years old. So it is, uh, it is something else. Um, I, I guessed. And uh, back when I was in high school and, and like doing marathons and triathlons and stuff, uh, playing basketball and stuff, I was known as the guy who never gassed. I just gotta realize that I'm old now, I'm older, and I just don't have the stamina I used to have. Um, so I just count it as a blessing that I'm able to wrestle and, and do this at all. But uh, yeah, got muscular fatigue. My hand was literally shaking like this throughout the entire uh, second half of the, the match. Um, yeah, it was, it was crazy. Um, but uh, you know what the really cool thing was? Um, uh, so we had some wrestle-offs and I wrestled up against guys like 210 pounds, something like that, and I weighed about 260. So it was unfair, but uh, I went and I wrestled and I, uh, I beat him seven to three. And uh, no, seven to four, he had an escape. I, I actually let him up so I could just score another takedown on him. And uh, yeah, so I beat him seven to four. And uh, at the end, the coach said, hey, just want everybody to, to look over here. This guy is 37 years old, about to turn 38. He just won his first match. Oh, he just won his first match in 20 years. Uh, because it was the first time we had uh, like an official match between others. Uh, so uh, you don't know how it is to, to go out there and give it your all. And this guy's out here living his dream. And then like the whole team started cheering and like, yeah, good job, man. So it was, uh, it was really cool. Uh, really uh, heartwarming. Uh, the coach actually teared up because he was saying, yeah, I know, I went, I served a, a mission for the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints after high school. And so uh, I was about three years removed from the sport when I went and I wrestled D1 or D2. And, uh, and it, was a, it was a crazy experience, like winning my first match, my first tournament. So. I know how Joe, that's my name, my real name is Joseph, I know how Joe feels right now and uh, yeah, so that's uh, just, it was, it was really heartwarming. Uh, anyway, I, uh, I had a, a really good experience, hmm, don't know if I have future Zen Booster Gold, I think I do, if I don't I'm going to regret passing on him. Cause I'm really never in this area. Oh, I'm gonna switch this around. I'm not the highlight of the video. Oop, there you go. <laughs> anyway, um, eh, thanks for listening to my story time. <laughs> I, I'm fairly certain I have that. Here's some McFarlane statues. Uh, yeah. Fairly certain I have that booster bomb, but anyway, it was uh, it was pretty. It was, it was a touching moment. He got all choked up, and uh, at the time I was like all on adrenaline and whatnot. But afterward, when I was telling to my wife, I got choked up. I had tears in my eyes, and it was a uh, it was a cool experience. Uh, and I appreciate the the coaches giving me some props. And but on a, oh, I need to work on my. Oh my gosh, I got. <laughs> I need to work on my stamina, my especially my right bicep. It is shot. So I didn't wrestle heavyweight when I was in high school, but I'm wrestling heavyweight now, and um, I need to learn how to wrestle heavyweight. Like uh, I can't go all out really in the beginning because a lot of heavyweights just sit there and kind of stall and wait for you to gas out. 
So I need a, another Hawkman. Weird. They figure out how to deal with that. Um, but anyway, um, I'm going to have a special treat at the end of this video. I, uh, <clears throat> I'm actually all the way out here because there's a, a Letterman jacket place that is uh, working on my... I have that one. I was working on my Letterman jacket and uh, they said it was going to be ready after my practice was done. A little after 8. So my practice ended at 8. So uh, they said, yeah, just come out here. It's only about 30 minutes away from where... Uh, my practices are held so I'm on my way there and I saw this target I've never seen before and I figured I'll give it a shot and look at it but uh, yeah it looks like they don't have I mean they potentially have that future Zen booster gold but other than that it's not looking like anything here but uh, I'll go ahead ooh ooh I love gravity falls Oh, let's see. Travels to dimensions meant for older readers. Oh, the Book of Bill. That's tempting. Um, I'm going to skip on it just because money's a little tight right now, especially with the holiday season. But people, please, in the comment section, remind me to circle back on this book uh, when I have time to start reading again, when I'm done with my PhD. Uh, that's one I'm going to want to read. Uh, if you haven't seen Gravity Falls, I highly recommend it. I don't care how old you are, it's a good show. Uh, really fun. Uh, and make sure you pay attention even on episode one for tiny little details. Look at the background, look at all these things. It's uh, it's worth it. Anyway, uh, I'll talk to you all in a second uh, when I pick up my new Letterman jacket. So as promised, here is the new Letterman jacket. I had my name added here. And I had this C for captain added as well because I am captain of the men's team. And then also, I went ahead and I had added to the back this uh, wrestling stitch uh, on the, uh, the back of the jacket. So really happy with how it turned out. Anyway, thank you all so very much for being a part of this channel. Um, I know it was a non-traditional haul, but I was really excited about it. So, uh, yeah, uh, I really appreciate all of your patronage. Uh, make sure that you like the video because it makes me feel good and I appreciate it. Also, make sure to comment down in the comments because that enrolls you in a giveaway. And then outside of that, uh, please add to the subscriber count because once we hit those subscriber milestones, then we get those giveaways. Uh, so everybody who commented will then be able to profit uh, from those giveaways. Um, yeah, outside of that, I uh, hope you're all doing well in your hunts. Please let me know how you're doing, and I'll see you in the next video.